Hey guys, welcome to my channel. How's it going? I hope you're all doing really, really well. Welcome to my pantry. Um, uh, yeah, so this is a food shop video. I'm filming in the pantry because the light is okay and it's dark outside and the rest of the light in my house is crap. So um, I'm just literally in the pantry just because the light's best. Um, so yeah, this is a food shop. It's from Asda. I think it was like £53. I put it on the screen exactly how much it was. Um, we're trying to get one big shop delivered a week um if we can i haven't been able to book one for next week so i really don't want to go out i don't like going out um but i'm gonna go online straight after i filmed this and see if i can book an aldi click and collect because there's one on the other side of the city for next weekend um but yeah i'm doing slimming world at the moment i've got three children they are six five and one and a half and then my other half is ben um yeah so i kind of do family meals and I will take you through the shopping and then I will talk you through the meal plan. This is an old meal plan on my blackboard, we'll ignore that. We might have a few things the same, but um, that's not today's one. Um, so yeah, I'm going to put the shopping away. We'll show you guys, then I'll put the shopping away and then we'll have a chat about the meal plan. Um, I've been doing Slimming World since the 16th of December. Today is the, is it the 16th of January, so maybe a month and I've lost £10. Um, but yeah let's jump in if you like these videos give it a thumbs up subscribe that'd be amazing if you aren't already i would really really appreciate it uh, let's go see the shopping okay so the shopping is here um it looks so neat but it's because this area of my kitchen is a shit tip and i wanted to just give you a bit of realness it's not like like yeah this is not real life that that is real life but this is my shopping to show you so um, i'll try and make it so you can actually see it we've got some tomatoes these are my favorite i absolutely love these it's only me and ben that really eat these foxy used to but he stopped radishes love mini salad peppers if i know the sins of anything i'll put it i'll tell you and if not i'll research it and put it on the screen when i edit um parmesan um we all love parmesan in this house you can have 30 grams of this for your healthy extra a and that is a lot of cheese so that's i really love that uh, cucumber i've got some puff pastry because i'm going to make the kids some pesto pinwheels two lots of orange squash um i got myself some decaf tea i normally have clipper but that is literally like seven pounds a box um so i thought i would try the tetley decaf and see if it's disgusting um some tuna for foxy man to try some worcester sauce because i've just run out i normally get this from cash and carry um like macro but i'm not going at the moment just because i'm trying to limit going out um a chili con carne mix um i'll put the sins for that on the screen i can't remember off the top of my head some flumps again i can't remember the sins on these but i'll put it on the screen um, i think they're like one and a half each or two um, but me and the kids both love them the girls not fox obviously because he's one and a half he doesn't have marshmallows um light mozzarella you can have 70 grams of light mozzarella which is amazing some lentil chips i love lentil chips they're like my favorite crisps they're so nice and crunchy um, the other ones i get are like five sins per serving so i don't know about these so I'll, again i'll put it on the screen melba toast mika really likes these um with her lunch got some tuck biscuits for fox to try um, some chocolate chips because we keep trying to make a cookie in the air fryer and it keeps going wrong so we're going to keep trying and i also like chocolate chips in yogurt as a treat yes my nails are tipex before anyone asks it is actual tipex i was showing mika earlier on um, and it's just brought me back to being 15. Um, some tubes for mika and aria i normally get like the as the cheap ones but they didn't have any um that's the thing with shopping in a pandemic you can't always get what you need so um, I had to go for these ones. That was they won't eat their little from our trays anymore. So I went for those. Um, savory eggs. Mika loves them. My almond milk. I ordered three of these because um, you can only get these in the big supermarkets. So even if Ben pops out to our little one, you can't get this. And they only had one when I ordered three, and they sent me two lots of Khalifa coffee, um, which I can't have. So I've sent that back. Uh, milk for everyone else. I got two lots of this. It's seriously strong. I love this. You get 55 grams for your healthy extra A and I like to melt it and then put it on veggies or um, mix it into pasta and it's just absolutely delicious. It's like one of my favourites. So we go through like at least one or two tubs of this a week because Ben will have it as well. I've got myself some Lindels. These are uh, half a sin each. I've got the white chocolate ones, two of those and 
two of the Stracatella, the chocolate ones, the white chocolate chip ones. I've got one 10 cow jelly, they're half a sin as well. Got some dough balls because we're going to have spaghetti bolognese one night, and Aria just loves dough balls and she'd have them every meal if I let her. Uh, chicken breasts, lean mints, eggs, um, tea bags for Ben, yogurts for Foxy. I got these for Fox to try as well. I wasn't sure if he might like them. I used to love these. I've not had them in a while, but I think they're probably even the girls would like them because they're nice and crunchy. Um, a lettuce, two lots of sugar just because I've run out in my pantry. Um, I got these, which I've never had before. Obviously, I've had what's inside it, but I've never had this specific one. Broccoli, cauliflower, and carrot mix, oil from um, in five minutes. So again, this is something like this is all speed veg, even though it's frozen. And then I like melt some of that on it, and it's just bloody delicious. So that's a really nice thing to have, nice and quick and easy. Because I won't lie, the kids won't eat anything here. Mika would eat carrots, but she doesn't like them cooked. She eats them raw. And um, Ben prefers raw carrots. And he will eat the other stuff if I fall, if I put it on his plate, but he'd rather not have it. So I'm not going to lie and say they all love their vegetables. They like raw vegetables and salad vegetables, but cooked stuff is just me. So this is easy for me to grab a handful and cook. Um, green beans, again, we've run out this week. Peas, we've run out this week. Um, I normally make my own Yorkshire puddings, but uh, my middle child refuses to eat homemade ones and just wants these crap ones. So that's what she's got. Um, cauliflower, because I love cauliflower. Uh, waffles because we go through a pack of these a week um, I saw this on someone's Instagram you can have 30 grams or 40 grams for your healthy extra B I'll put it on the screen and it looks delicious so it's coconut cashew and almond granola and I just thought that looks amazing so I've got that and then some Cheerios because again they're a they can be a healthy extra B and Fox has them as a snack so that was my shopping I'm going to put it away and then I'll talk to you about the meal plan morning guys shopping's all the way it is like three days later i'm not gonna lie um but i have done a full meal plan for the whole week breakfast lunch and dinner every single day yesterday was way day um and we had a granola with fruit and yogurt um leftover pasta for lunch and then fish and chips homemade fish and chips for tea um if you, i put pictures of everything on my weight loss instagram if you want to see that i will film another what i eat in a day video with a weight update i'm going to film that today um, today um, I was going to have black rice, yogurt and banana for breakfast um, and some grapefruit and oranges but the rice had weevils in it so that had to go in the bin um, so I'm making it with a Oreo rice so basically like kind of like rice pudding but made with water um, I've done enough for four portions and then I'll just separate it out into four portions so it's not like we're, I'm going to overeat it I'll portion it out into proper portions um, but I'm, I've not done it with that, so I don't know if it's going to work. It's in the pressure cooker at the moment, so we'll see. Um, I'll put a picture on of the black rice, how I usually have it. Um, it's delicious. Um, and it's just like a porridge alternative, but it's really nice and filling. Um, for lunchtime, I'm going to have potato, egg and beans. I'm not sure if it's going to be hash browns or just little potatoes. I don't know yet. Um, dinner tonight is pita pizza or wrap pizza. I can't remember which one I've got. I think I've got pitas in the freezer, so I need to get one of them out. Um, tomorrow is granola, uh, yogurt and then fruit and when I say fruit I normally have a banana, a grapefruit and an orange, um, always a grapefruit and an orange, always and then sometimes I add a banana on it as well. Um, the granola I'm using at the moment is a Kellogg's one and it is absolutely amazing, it's a no added sugar, um, I'll put a picture of it and it's like coconut, cashew and almond and you can have 35 grams for your healthy bee and it is absolutely amazing. So tomorrow I'm going to have half of that for breakfast, then two rovitas with ham and salad for lunch and then we're having sausages and mash for dinner and I'll be having the Aldi skinny sausages because they're um, half a cent each for two, so one cent for two. Um, Saturday, hash browns, bacon, egg and beans for breakfast, pita and salad for lunch, burger in a bowl for dinner. Everyone else will just have burger for dinner. I might not make burger in a bowl, I might just do burgers and everyone will be bothered. Um, Sunday, oat pancakes um, for breakfast, potato cakes and egg for lunch, roast chicken for dinner. And then Monday, granola fruit and yogurt, jack of potato, beans and cheese, and then risotto for dinner and I'll do the leftover chicken from the roast in the risotto. And then 
Tuesday was meant to be black rice. Um, if I've got some by then it'll be black rice. If not, it'll be something else. And then Ravita ham, cheese, salad. And then I'm gonna do a veggie chili. Um, I've, I think I've got some meat chili in the fridge, in the freezer because Ari won't eat vegetarian chili, like just with beans in, and um, she won't eat that, but Mika really likes it. So I normally get a big one of, uh, get a sort of a portion out of the meat one and then uh, defrost it. Ari will have just meat and then I'll add in the veggie one into the meat one for Mika and she'll have it a, bit, a meat one with loads and loads of beans in it because she loves beans. Um, but that's the weekly meal plan. Um, this is the first time that I've done it where I've literally planned everything other than my snacks but I've only used um like the most I've used in all of that is one sin a day for meals and then I like to have my full 15 sins at night with snacks um which is mostly nuts lentil crisps chocolate rainbow drops frozen grapes um yeah so that's the meal plan let me know how you're getting on um, as I said, I'm going to film a What I Eat in a Day video now for today, which will have an update on weight loss in it. Uh, but yeah, I think that's all. I'll leave all the links. I'll leave my weight loss on Instagram down below. And I'm nearly at 1,000 followers. It's ridiculous. I really like it. I'm getting a bit addicted to it. But it really keeps me accountable. Um, oh, the pressure cooker is building um, by taking a picture of every single thing that I eat. Um, and I've got another friend who is doing Slimming World. Um, she uh, does the same with me. She's paid for a countdown as well. But then my other friend who lives in Nottingham, she lost two and a half stone last year and she's amazing. She is slowly getting back to it. She had like six weeks off sort of over Christmas and New Year. Um, and she's not doing a meeting at the moment, but we have our own meeting on a Thursday. We video call for like an hour and we talk about what we're having for the week um, just to kind of help her stay on track and that's just and we like to have a little catch up like we've been friends since we were 17 um but we haven't seen each other the last time i saw her mika had just been born so we haven't seen each other for like six years uh, but we talk like every single day um, and we video call at least once a week so yeah that is the plan so if you are planning to do swimming world or um you want to do it but you don't want to pay then i am thinking about maybe starting up like a little where we can because i think you can do rooms now on instagram aren't you with like more people to chat so we could do like a little sort of weekly chat about what we're having and how we're feeling so let me know if anyone would be interested in that um obviously this, we wouldn't, it's not paying for anything it would just be us chatting so um if enough people want to do it then i'll think about it and see if it's something we could fit in uh yeah my rice is now cooking so if you want to see how it turns out watch the video that i'm going to link up here when it comes out thanks for watching i'll see you soon bye guys